Hey you guys, wanted to share with you my second flashlight build. This is a uh, Convoy S2 host that I made with a uh, kind of custom setup that I think is really awesome and it's a very powerful flashlight. This is actually one of my bright brightest flashlights that I own and let me tell you real quick what I did with this thing. So like I said, it's a Convoy S2 host which is about like, uh, like 10 bucks. I think I paid for it. It's got a Nichia 219C LED, which is a really nice, really uh, good color LED. It's kind of a neutral white and uh, really nice color to it. It's got the uh, orange peel reflector and the uh, glass in the front there. Added the uh, deep carry pocket clip. It's kind of cheap, but it gets the job done. In the rear here, we have a uh, glow in the dark boot for the switch. And we also have a uh, magnet. I put a magnet ring into the uh, tail cap there so that I can uh, put it on things. But of course you can see the uh, actually that pocket clip doesn't need to be there. It can actually be down here. <laughs> um, so that way I can, it can tail stand and uh, is magnetic. You can stick it to things if you're fixing, plus pocket carry, lanyard hole, all that jazz. Now the internals, what did I do with this bad boy? Now the Nichia 219C, the 219C, is a pretty good LED. It's one of the better ones on the market. It's easily capable of 1,000 plus lumens and uh, can handle pretty high uh, amperage as well. So I put what's known as a uh, direct drive into this, which is basically a uh, driver that utilizes multiple channels and one of them is direct drive for your turbo mode which pretty much means the thing is running straight off the battery with the only resistance being the resistance in the actual flashlight components. And then it has six other modes of brightness that utilize a uh, basically a driver that will control the uh, current running through the flashlight. So it has uh, seven different brightness modes total, a moonlight, a turbo, like two lows, two middles, two highs, that kind of jazz. So it's a good spacing and uh, my guesstimate is this is around 1200 or 1300 lumens based on comparing it to other known flashlights. It's uh, pretty good. I checked it. The uh, turbo mode draws about three and a half amps at the tail cap, but it's probably a little bit higher than that. It's probably closer to four because I have a crappy uh, multimeter and it has really long leads on it. So the amperage is probably a bit higher than that. And guessing based on the lumens, I'm guessing it's around four amps. So this thing turns on and it actually uses the uh, Budget Light Forum A6 driver, which you can get through uh, banggood.com. And the first mode when it turns on is always uh, moonlight, which I do like. I never like to blind myself, especially when you're in a car at night or something like that. You do not want to be turning on your uh, your light and having this thing go uh, like 1,200 lumens in a car or something like that. So the moonlight mode, we'll turn this light off so you can kind of see it, is uh, decent. I like that coloring, you know, that LED coloring. It's a really nice uh, neutral light. It's got a little bit of a hot spot with a ring around it. Really good uh, beam profile. Stepping it up to number two. You can see we have a real nice color there. We're going to bring it up again and again. And you see this thing's getting really bright, even brighter. I mean, this thing is uh, no joke, guys. It's pretty bright. And brighter, and even brighter, and back down to moonlight. So also can reverse as well. So you can leave it on that moonlight. And I can do a long press and it will, oh, I didn't do it. It kind of takes a little tricky to get used to. Bam, right into turbo. Turbo gets very hot very fast. I mean, within 20, 30 seconds, this thing is scorching hot. But that turbo is pretty cool if you ask me. So we're going to bring that back over to moonlight before we burn the house down. And actually, I think what we're going to do, if you give me one second to get my to kids' toy towel out of the way, we're in the uh, plays in this room a lot, 
we're going to go over to the window and uh, take a look at the beam out of the sucker. If we can detach here. All right, let's get this window open. Oops, let's unlock it. All right, I bet you there's a rabbit in the backyard too. All right. Let's get this to focus. Zoom on out. This is turbo mode. Let's see if we can see the rabbit. No, he's not back here today. But you can see there's my garage. There's my fire pit, which is like 50 yards away. Flashlight's already getting pretty hot. But you can see it's a really nice beam profile. We're going to knock that down, actually. You don't scorch my hand. You can see it's a pretty decent hot spot with uh, here's my kid's swing set, fence, garage. That's just the one of the middle modes. Pin that up. I really like the uh, really like the uh, beam profile on this thing. Uh oh. Ooh, there we go. <laughs> you can see, we can see into the trees very well. See, very good. Quite a bright flashlight. Easily a couple hundred lumen. Lights up pretty much the whole yard. You can see it's got a nice kind of focused beam. Yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. So that's that.